Hello everybody, this is uh, Dark64Boom. Today I'm going to be doing a commentary series called The Failure of Pro Man United Fan. This guy is probably the dumbest Sony fanboy ever. I mean, this guy is really stupid. This guy. Basically, I'm going to do a commentary on four videos of, by him. Is why I'm not going to get Nintendo 3DS, his DS vs. PSP Part 1 and 2, and is why Mar the, Ma the Mario series sucks. So, we're going to go through, I'm going to go through four of them. Then, um, yeah. Basically, his main problem when he does the rant is that he can't make a fucking point to save his life. And most of his points are mostly opinions. When he, try to make, when he does try to make a fact, I can debunk it. Alright, let's start. Oh, and he also stirs a lot too, if I almost forgot. Yes, he stirs a lot. Maybe he should take a script. Just letting you know, maybe you should write a script for your rant. Let's start it. Hey guys, I've recently watched Nintendo's E3 press conference announcement. I am talking like this. I just saw Nintendo 3DS kid talks right, talk in a freaking like a freaking talk of speed, so I can understand. You don't talk like this. Talk like this. And this month, Nintendo have released the new Nintendo DS. Um, it's called the 3DS, which is basically supposed to be an all-round improved version of the Nintendo. Wrong. It's supposed to be basically a replacement for the Nintendo DS, basically, dude. Because there's going to be games on the 3DS that only play on the 3DS. Can't play on the DS. Wrong. DS, basically, um, a mix between the PSP and the DS. How does the 3DS look anyway, like, the PSP, alright? Your analog bullshit does that that does not work, alright? Just because the analog stick is on the three DS doesn't mean it. you know why? Because you know what a D pad is for the where the DS was originally at? That was the, there was a D pad there, not an analog stick. Unlike the PSP, there's still a D pad there and the analog stick's on the bottom, not on the on the middle part of the of the thing. So uh yeah, sorry, that argument you just made is bullshit. And by the way, um your analog stick, I'm gonna destroy you in that argument. The 3DS basically improved their graphics. Um, yeah, the graphics ain't bad, but still think the I still think Sony stands king of of handheld consoles graphic ability. Two things: one, handhelds are not consoles, you dumb twat. And two, uh, are you kidding me? Have you seen Metal Gear Solid uh, 3's DS graphics, dude? They basically destroy anything on the PSP. There's, besides God of War and Twisted Metal and gr the GTA games, those are those are probably the, the best graph graphically best games on the PSP. And what I've seen from the 3DS, it looks absolutely great. It looks brilliant. Have you seen Metal Gear Solid 3's graphics on the 3DS? It looks brilliant. It, it almost looks like the freaking PlayStation 2, but you can tell. If you zoom in, you can tell, because it is pixelated, but it's still good. Damn. Oh, and I almost forgot. Kid Chris looks really good, too. I almost forgot about that game. Another game I gotta check out. Um, the PSP still has better graphics than the 3DS. And the 3DS, um, are basically making more hardcore games for, for it. Like they never did with their handhelds and consoles before. Like, they've never done this before.
Nintendo are basically making more hardcore games for their handheld console. Um, which is, which is good, good, because you gotta please everybody when it comes to handheld consoles. You gotta, gotta give the. They're not consoles. They're handhelds. A console is something you play at home, not on your hands. You idiot. A handheld is where you can play in your hands, and it's portable. Not a con consoles are not portable. Handhelds are portable. So that's why they're called handhelds. Gotta give the hardcore gamers a good selection, and you gotta give the casual gamers a good selection. And possibly the only good point I actually agree with him. For a handheld, you do need a vi like a casual and hardcore games on your handheld. I that's one statement I will agree with him. That's about it. So far. PS the PSP Sony have basically given a well, quite a reliable quite a reliable um variety well, quite a good variety of casual games games for casual gamers and and a good variety of um, games for hardcore gamers as well you're just repeating yourself dude make new sentences you just repeat yourself that's it like I just did um and basically oh um Nin Nintendo Nintendo are basically ripped off Sony by by um changing their controls well adding something to their controls. They're basically ripped off Sony. They've added something to the controls which um I find which I consider a rip off of Sony's I sir find it's offensive. I'm gonna bitch about it. Oh Control. You wanna you wanna guess what it is? Guess what it is. Go on, I'll bet you not. The analog stick. This is possibly the dumbest point this idiot has ever made. Like, oh, the 3DS ripped off PSP because of the analog stick. Alright, kid, you know what? That is that is a shitty argument to begin with. You know why? So what if the D 3DS had an analog stick? You know what? Sony is copying Nintendo of the analog stick. The Nintendo 64, like, had analog stick before PlayStation 1 did. And before it Saturn did, not it. Like by a month, just by a month. So you guys can even look it up because it had it by a month. And and do do they really look like similar? Do the analogs really look similar? And besides, like the analog stick on the PSP, like I said earlier, was on the bottom of this on the handheld. The analog stick on the DS is on the middle where you usually have the D-pad at, like for if you're like classic hardcore gamers, like on NES and stuff. And and they look like. They don't look identical. They look so different. And to be honest, when I first saw the PSP's analog stick, I thought that was a speaker. Cause, and the PSP's analog stick is so stiff. It, it, I don't like it. I really That's one of the flaws of the PSP, in my opinion, guys. I hate the analog stick. Probably one of the worst analog sticks. So let's continue. And... And complete... Coincidence the the nin <coughs> Oh, and by the way, kid, uh Sony rips off a lot of people, like recently the PlayStation move. Oh wow, what does that look like? I don't know. Maybe the Wii? I don't know, I'm just putting that out there. You know what I mean? True, uh, yeah, connecting PlayStation Move are trying stuff out for casual gamers. I mean at least Xbox Connect is actually trying to be original. Unlike the freaking PlayStation Move. The Nintendo 3DS's analog stick feels exactly the same. Well, looks exactly the same. So are you telling me an analog stick looks like something that actually looks like an analog stick on the 3DS, alright? Analog stick on the PSP looks like a speaker. 
it looks like a speaker, dude. The analog stick and the 3DS analog stick look nothing alike. You, you gotta be high to say that, dude.